Noise from ships interfere with the ability of endangered killer whales to talk to each other and hunt, suggests a new study. Researchers found underwater sound pollution along the coast of the Pacific disrupts how orcas communication with each other, and interferes with their ability to track and hunt salmon. They said the unprecedented study of ship noise will help biologists understand the potential effects it has on marine life, and help discover ways to reducing the interference. Scientists set out to discover if noise from a nearby shipping lane interferes with the orca's ability to send out clicks and listen for their echoes in the ocean off Seattle while hunting salmon. The researchers measured underwater noise as ships passed their study site 3,000 times. They said the unprecedented characterization of ship noise will aid in the understanding of the potential effects on marine life, and help with ways of reducing the interference. Research has shown that the growth in commercial shipping has raised the intensity of low-frequency noise in the ocean almost tenfold since the 1960s. Because the noise occurs at similar low frequencies used by baleen whales there is growing evidence it may impact their ability to communicate, and therefore their survival. But the team behind the new research wanted to know if ship noise could extend to the higher frequencies used by toothed whales and therefore pose similar threats to them. To analyze the nature of ship noise, particularly in coastal areas close to ports, scientists measured around 1,600 unique ships as they traveled through Harrow Strait, in Washington state. This is a critical habitat for the endangered southern resident killer whales. The orcas are iconic in the Pacific Northwest and support a multi-million dollar ecotourism industry in the United States and Canada. Because the orcas, like other toothed whales, use mid and high frequencies to communicate and find their prey, the study measured a wide range of frequencies, 10 Hz to 40,000 Hz. Study author Dr. Scott Vares, of Beam Reach Marine Science and Sustainability School, said, the results show that ships are responsible for elevated background noise levels not only at low frequencies as expected, but also at medium and higher frequencies, including at 20,000 Hz where killer whales hear best. This means that in coastal environments where marine mammals live within a few kilometers of shipping lanes, ship noise has the potential to interfere with both communication and echolocation. He added, the study is unique because it estimates the source levels of larger populations and more classes of ships than in previous studies. Overall, container ships exhibited the highest median source levels at all frequencies below 20,000 Hz. Military vessels had some of the lowest levels, suggesting that transfer of quieting technology to the commercial sector could be a successful noise mitigation strategy. The study shows that another potential way to reduce noise pollution is to simply slow down. The figures suggest that, on average, each reduction in a ship's speed by one knot could reduce broadband noise levels by one decibel.